ladies and gents, I'm the Rev, and this is Imperion Galactic Survival, and today we're going to do something a little different. Um, I've been having a lot of fun, you know, one of the biggest things about this game is I love making the ships, so any reason to get into it, so I was playing around, and I came across this, Dawn of the Galaxy, choose this scenario if you are a real explorer and adventurer, discover unique planets and missions, which will challenge, but also reward you. The higher you get in levels, the more missions you will unlock. Your final goal, find the ship Dano CV-X7 and capture it to get the ultimate power in your hands. So you can do this single player or co-op. And you can set your difficulty level. You can set your seed. So you can have it generate different ways. You can have it start on one of two planets, just like in the uh, sandbox. There, it's Omicron, and I can't think of the other one. And this one, and Omicron would be the, the Mai. Or you can start in the orbit. Um, or you start here in Elia versus Akira. And it, this is actually a smaller planet. It has less... Uh, points of interest. I did not find all the little uh, outposts and stations, so I didn't get any epic weapons yet. But what we're going to do is I'm going to show you guys what you get to start out with here. And then we're going to jump forward and we're going to take on one a little bit later of a mission. And then we're going to go from there. So hold on one second. And we're going to start this bad boy up. Alrighty, folks. So once you have started and you're on the planet... We go to, um, first, of course, we have our Find Your Personal Cargo Box, which is what's right in front of us. And that is all good stuff we're going to want to take. And one thing you're going to want to make sure of is that you follow what the game says on the right so that you make sure you tick things off in order. Otherwise, uh, the game won't progress. It doesn't let you jump around. So you have to make sure you do exactly what it says. So next, we need to fill our ammo from the control panel which is easy just go right here there we go go outside and check your home loot the artifact so to do that you gotta of course go out here oh such a beautiful day here all right so we've got of course oh much better much better out here what is this there we go there's our any and not fact over here we have of course medic station and o2 but you don't need it because we're on a planet what is this thing oh wow this one had squat in it oh okay so you see how it gives us the drill mission completed hey you start message we need your help please come to may orbit and clear the Station before coming for fairy stuff and reach a higher level. Bigger Mitchell is waiting for you. Okay, so we've got our drill, a motorbike to get around, and a repair station to repair said drill, and five drill charges. So, as always, what I recommend is get away from the radiation. You want to use one each of the drill charges for iron, copper, cobalt. And then, of course, our uh, fuel packs, Promethean. So you're going to want to take and make sure that you use at least um, one to two of the drill charges to make sure that you get enough power so you can keep everything running. I would also suggest going in and just go through and shut everything off that you're not going to be using. Because most of the stuff you aren't going to need. And then there is one other thing that will definitely help you... Um, get your level up quick and that is you come down here ooh, ooh, and we, of course we've got our kitchen right more supplies you can go into the kitchen counters and then we've got this nice huge ta -da, thing of food so basically between going out and getting each of the uh, minerals that you need. Oh, that one's not ready yet. There we go. Then you hit. Oh, I can't get one. You're standing in them. There we go. 
You just come down here, grab these guys. See, boom, we've already got to level four. Because um, you get 300 XP with most of this. So as you're running around, of course, pick any and everything that you can. If you can't use it, just throw it away in the trash. But it's all about getting your experience up as quick as possible so that you can unlock everything. Because just like in the normal game, you start with nothing with your tech tree here. You can see we've got... That's our gun. Tools... We can't even make our drill. We can make a regular crappy drill. But there you go. And see, we've got all this food now. And we can just go on over here. Again, make sure we're shutting everything down except only what we're going to be using. I'd move all the food back over here. And there you go. That's the easy way. You just use your drill charges, go out, get minerals, uh, come back, do a harvest, eat go back out get more minerals back forth back and forth uh it does do a really nice job of as you can see here we've got just about most of the things that we need copper is i think the only one that's not super close but all you got to do is just do a circle and it'll pop up for you so it's not hard there's 10 of them on the planet so all righty folks so now we're gonna jump ahead to where i have a save that has a ship built and we're going to go check out this alien cruiser, which is, I think, the third mission. So hold on, and we'll be right back. All right, so once you have completed the first two missions, which basically just completely <clears throat> set you up, help you build your ship get you ready to fly we need to go find the invader ship and it's not too difficult you're going to be going up there looking anyways so what i would advise whoa it's loud is while you go up here and you're searching a make sure that you've got a ship that's got more than enough firepower um, and make sure that you've got a ship that can take some damage because we're going to get hit going in here. Um, but you can look for uh, the stuff that you're going to need to make your own capital ship, which would be Sathium and some of the other things up here in orbit. As you can see here when it comes to... Whoa, shaking through. We've got all these asteroids, right? And so there's Sathium, Neodyne. Those are the two that you're going to need so you can build your various components for your capital ship. And there it is. That's the alien invader. It uh, wasn't moving. It uh, I just I flew up here, did a couple of laps, and boom, the there it is. The easy way to beat this thing is just to fly uh, in behind it. Now before you do, you're going to want to make sure you take out these little drones because they will come after you. As you can see, they're starting to here. And I always suggest the old minigun. Oh, where'd they go? Well, if they're not going to play, then that's fine. Now you can try and shoot this thing if you want. Personally, I have found it's easier to do what I'm about to do. Uh, if we can get in here. Okay. There's the front. All right. Whoa! There we go. Oh, very good. That was an important ship from our enemies. You can use it something, something. Okay. Whoa! All right. Now, if we're stationary, is it still going to be shooting at us? Okay, so let's see what the PDA says. Okay, so now that we flew at it, then we went to finally take over the, the EX-7 station. Maybe there is so, still someone alive. Alrighty, folks, so after looking at the map, the system map, May is the next uh, planet that we have to go to, and it says May Dobra... 
Python. So it looks like three more cool planets we're going to get to check out. Now, if you want, there is a station that you can attack up here. And I don't know. These things do tend to have uh, the epic weapons. The only problem is, and one of the things you're going to run into as you're running around on our planet here, is that there is uh, not a lot of things to fight. There is one little um, alien base kind of thing, and it takes like two seconds to wipe out. Other than that, there's not that much. So what we're going to do is I'm going to take and work on building a capital ship. And when we come back in the next episode, we are going to uh, journey to Mai and see what's going on with that. Um, I don't know. Unless I really feel the need to go to the Thermeca station. I don't know. Oof. I have to think about that. Anyways, folks, please like, favorite, and subscribe. Uh, I gotta go down and work on my capital vessel here, so please keep your heads down. Uh, yo, guns up. And I'll see you again. Once we clear the skies. <laughs>